country singer Megan Maroney says career prevents her from finding someone that I want to marry right now. Megan Maroney is getting real about how her country music career is affecting her love life. During a recent interview with RZ News, the MIOK singer spoke about her life as a country music artist and how it has permeated into every aspect of her life, including her romantic relationships. I think I've never been more dialed in with my career than I am now, she said. I really don't have time for a relationship, and I think it's reflected in my album. There's two love songs that are maybe kind of hopeful, and then it ends real quick, and that is an accurate representation of how my love life recently went. So, yeah, I'm focused on the music and my career, and that's kind of all about all I have time for right now. Aside from her busy schedule keeping her from branching out, Maroney doesn't think she is in the right headspace to enter a serious relationship. Please subscribe to RZ News for more updates. I think because I'm not emotionally available, like, I am not ready to find someone that I want to marry right now, because that's just not in even the top 10 things in my brain right now, she explained. So it's just like. Let's not waste anyone's time. Let's just not date right now because there's that point. Maroney's career took off when her song Tennessee Orange went viral on TikTok following its release in December 2022. The song continued to gain traction when fans began speculating it was about fellow country music artist, Morgan Wallen. The success of the song came as a surprise to Maroney who said that you can't really predict when something will go viral like that. It's just it's hit or miss and that there are probably millions of good songs that don't go viral, but they are still good songs. Since her debut album was released in May 2023, Maroney's star power has only increased. She is currently on tour with country music legend Kenny Chesney. Maroney called their time together the best summer ever and that she'll be a mess when it's over. He's become a mentor for me and a close friend, and I just am so grateful for him. I watch him every night. And, you know, he doesn't have a huge production. He's just that good of a performer, she said. And I think on top of being a crazy good performer, his songs are just so good. Like. He plays for two hours and can't play all the hits. And I'm like, that is just such a goal of mine. And so I definitely look up to him in a lot of ways as an artist. She went on to say she grew up listening to him, so going on to become friends with him now is really cool.